Welcome back, wrestling fans. This is Dean Gordon welcoming you back to PWF's All-Star Wrestling Extravaganza number 8 from the Citrus Dome in Orlando, Florida. Our next matchup is a big six-man tag team match. As we hear the music now for the Monarch, Terry Gold, as he gets ready to make his entrance. His regal and that music, Battle with that Honor of Humanity, that can only be for one person, a Super Ninja. So here's the music now for Sam Francisco, the Dean of Rashland, as he likes to call himself. First, it is Steel 78. And coming in next now is Bushido Kaiser. Billy Bob Hartrop, he's on the shelf currently because of Rex and his uh, hold of the wisdom of a man. As the match has gotten underway, Gerald McKinney, our referee, once again for this contest. Big slap in the face there by San Francisco. One of these three men, either San Francisco, Super Ninja, or Terry Gold, one of these three men are uh, the next likely contender for the Cruiserweight title. There were thoughts that maybe Billy Bob Hartrop would be, but he was taken out of action by Rex. 
Steel 78 now tagging to the ring, going up against Super Ninja. Oh, look at that, that's the F right there. Step over Toho's crossface. First step over Toho's face lock. Big chop there by the Super Ninja as he gets ready to tag in Terry Gold, the Monarch. And here comes a double team. Look at that move. Beautifully done. Backdrop of Sophie Katari combo. And look at that. Shote uppercut by Yoshida Kaiser. As Steel 78 was trapped in a bow and arrow lock. Terry Gold and Yoshida Kaiser now in the middle of... Well, not in the middle of the ring, but in the ring. And look at those nice Shote strikes. Completely legal as they are open-handed. And Bushido Kaiser, he loves using the Shote from all kinds of different angles and positions, whether it be running, in the corner, an uppercut, mounted, back mounted. He will use those open-handed strikes, and look at that iron claw right there. Kneeling, belly to belly, pile driver, beautifully done. And a one-handed face buster, Terry Gold is going to have to make a tag, and he does, right through the Super Ninja. Shido Kaiser not done with Gold yet, though, as he hits him with a DDT. Going. Terry Gold, he's got to get out of there, he is not the legal man. Nice show, pay up a cut there. Super Ninja with the Irish whip, both men collide. Here comes the Cruiserweight Champion Rex. Nice. Nice round heist to the face while he's wearing those bad boys. And Super Ninja comes back with a counter kick. The referee is giving these guys leeway lots of times. They're not the legal men. Rope break called for by Gerald McKinney. As Super Ninja was in the ropes. Rex pulling guard. Tried to get an armbar, I think. Super Ninja, though, interfering in that one. Big knee right there. Rex battling Super Ninja and Sam at the same time. Rex with those big hooks connecting to San Francisco's jaw. Fighting in Steel 78 as San Francisco got his own double leg take on. But countered into the, uh, in, into the uh, arm bar. Oh no, there it is, the Banshuku driver, look at that. Steel 78, double shame right there, having his head in San Francisco's tights, and then getting hit with a bad pile driver, but look at that, he recovered quickly, getting that diamond dust. Now, with the big fist drop on San Francisco, Terry Gold has been tagged in. He goes for a small package. Got a one count on Steel 78, catching him off guard, but look at that big turning neck breaker right there. And there's a jumping fist drop off the top rope to Terry Gold's abdomen. Gold now with a nice trip. In the ropes, that's going to be a rope break. European uppercuts, fired away by Terry Gold, knuckle arrows, filed by Steel 78, and look at that, Terry Gold, is, he doesn't profess to be a striker, but the last couple of times I've seen him involved in those exchanges, he's come out on top. Most notably, uh, here against Steel 78 in episode 21 of Wrestling at the Dojo, against Cholo Cali 209. Oh, reverse tombstone right there. Bushido Kaiser kicking out of that one. Super Ninja has been tagged in. He and Bushido Kaiser are the legal competitors. Ten minutes gone. This match has a 30-minute time limit. And look at that spinning strike right there. Two can as Bushido Kaiser kicks out. Fisherman Buster, nicely done there by Kaiser as he came for the figure four leg lock. Terry Gold is in, he breaks that up as all three members of that team are in now. Look at this, Bushido Kaiser trying to move away but got caught in a Mongolian chop by Super Ninja. 
Where to let to see, but he's not the legal man. There's no pinfall for that one. And Mancic Shote tasted his own medicine, I guess. Super Ninja. But look at this. All six men are now in the ring. This is Bedlam. Look at that double team there. Nice counter by Terry Gold. And another kneeling belly to belly call driver by Bushido Kaiser. He takes the opportunity now to tag in his partner Rex. Ooh, vertical drop rain buster. Terry Gold is going to be feeling that one. Big thrust kick there by Rex, but Terry Gold rolls up. I lost track of who the legal man was. Airplane spin. Rex is dumped. Rex coming out of it now. Close fist punches. His verification tag was on, but it was broken up quickly. Lindsay Gary right there. And Rex escaping that now as we are nearing 14 minutes. He has an eight tag in. Couldn't get the double team as Terry Gold fought out of it. Backslide. Rex quickly there to break that up. Steel 78 escaping. Didn't escape the second time though. What a short arm clothesline, but Terry Gold broke up the pin attempt from that muscle bomb press. And I'm just going to go ahead and call the breach and lock. I talked about that before. Every time I see that hold, I think about the old uh, archaeological reviews uh, showing ancient Greek wrestling and how that was a prominent hold. And look at that, that choke sleeper broken up by Steel 78. Sam, look at that. Sam got the better of that exchange. I'm a little bit surprised. I'm not surprised that Sam's kept this way. He's not a martial artist. There's a giant swing right now by San Francisco. Broken up by Steel 78. Steel 78 now throwing Super Ninja outside. Yoshido Kaiser is outside. Wisdom of a man has been locked in on Terry Gold. San Francisco broke that up. Super Ninja now bringing a chair into the fray. Drops the chair, but he's thrown back outside by Steel 78. Yoshido Kaiser and Rex now both going after Super Ninja. Super Ninja with a big kick. You see Terry uh, Gold and San Francisco. Looks like they're going after Steel 78. Light sweep there by Rex. Oh, look at that reverse pile, uh, reverse tombstone inside the ring by Steel 78. Kyote uppercuts. Look at that combo there. Look at that armbar on San Francisco by Rex. Super Ninja escapes, gets back into the ring, stops the tent. 18 minutes have passed. 18 and a half minutes. 30 minute time limit. And look at this, another double team dangle. Steel 78. Rex is saying it's over, might be a bit premature. Look at that extrusion high kick in San Francisco gives him a boot. There's a reversal. There's a rag. Anders with the big arm lock. Backslide on Bushido Kaiser. Super Ninja goes down from the collision with Steel 78. Steel 78 now with a big American punch rush on Kerry Gold. San Francisco battling out the double team. Rashida Kaiser is dazed. Extrusion high kick by Rex on to San Francisco. Canners with a drop toe hold though. Nice drop kick right there. Drop kick to the knee. San Francisco though. He is up. He is dazed. Pegs and here we go. 20 minutes have passed. Big DDT. There's an arm bar by Rex. San 
Mephisto going up. Oh, Harry Gold sabotaged his own partner. That was a mistake there. Steel 78 did a good job of evading the Fez press. But he couldn't avoid that pin. Broken up by Rex with a big kick to Terry Gold. Big rip break of a Terry Gold caught him in a rolling cradle. Steel 78 kicks out. Backslide coming up. Broken up again. Oh, look at that Superman kick on the San Francisco. He went clear across the ring. Terry Gold got taken down hard, and here comes the Dan Shuku driver. Steel 78 is day. Terry Gold off the rope. Fez Press. Broken up by Rex again. Tag is made now to Super Ninja. Oh, look at that cutter. Steel 78 going in to tag in Bushido Kaiser. It's now Bushido Kaiser and the Super Ninja who are the legal men as we are nearing the 24 minute mark. Oh, look at that big knee drop and a frog splash, but Steel 78 picked up Super Ninja. And look at that Tom strike. Steel 78's in at the ring. Oh, and Rex was the victim of a double team. This match. Endless waltz by Terry Gold, but he's not the legal man. Reversal on the Irish whip. The Ninja put on the brakes, but now look at these two men just viciously exchanging those strikes, and Super Ninja wins that one. Oh, but look at that. Right away with the counter. Nice running kick right there. Ranking right show, okay, will that be enough in? But no, Steel 78 makes the save. This six-man uh, six tag team match has just been full of action. Look at this now. Oh, look at that. Rex attacked San Francisco. There was a double team on Bushido Kaiser. I didn't even realize tags were made. That's how frenetic this action is. Nice take in there by Rex. San Francisco is not the legal man, though. It's Terry Gold. Terry Gold did a good job of blocking that punch. Backslide. Here comes Steel 78. He makes the save. There's one bringing a chop right there. Terry Gold off the ropes, Fez Press, he's going for the cover. Broken up again. And it is over, San Francisco tried to uh, break it up. But your winner, figure four leg lock, Yoshida Kaiser Steel 78 and Rex 2809. Folks, stay tuned for the next matchup, I don't know how they're going to top this.